Hi there, this is Serban and today I'm gonna show you the best 10 SIDA tweaks for your iOS devices on iOS 7. Just to let you know guys, every month I'm going to upload a new video to show you the best SIDA tweaks for each specific month. So please subscribe to catch those videos. Let's get back to the tweaks and the first one is slow-mo mode. This tweak enables slow motion video recording on unsupported devices like iPhone 5, iPhone 4, iPad or even Apple Touch. It's easy, just tap the camera button and swipe until you see slow mo, just like iPhone 5S, and record the video. Then tap stop, and you can see on the photos icon here. Well, it records the slow motion video on 60 FPS, whereas iPhone 5S records on 120 FPS. Also, it has the this drag lines so you can change the duration of your slow motion videos. It's really good. Also, while you install this tweak, another one will be installed automatically, which enables burst mode on unsupported devices like that. That's all, guys. The second one is Sleek Sleep. This is a virtual sleep button powered by proximity sensor which is only available on iPhone devices. This works by swiping your finger on this area here, as I'm gonna show you right now. It just replaces the power button, like that. You can see. The third twig is CC toggles. This twig allows you to add more toggles to your control center, as you can see here, by swiping this area. To do so, in settings, you can add more toggles here, as you can see, so you can please edit. Settings will be here. The other tweak is Swipe Selection Pro. This is one of the best tweaks so far on CDSO. This one replaces this magnifier on your eye devices. It's really easy, I'm just going to show you right now. You can swipe like that on the keyboard. You can select a specific word by dragging from shift, like that. Sometimes you can disable this tweak by triple tap on shift button here. So you can use other tweaks like I swipe or other tweaks that use keyboard. When the other tweak is I swipe keyboard. This is one of my favorite tweaks so far in CDA. This adds swipe keyboard on your iOS devices. If I write something like it also gives you suggestions for the words if you make mistakes. Another tweak is tiny bar. This tweak shrinks incoming notifications the same size of the status bar as you'll see right now. You see, it will be like that when you get incoming notifications. So you can change the, like, the height, whatever you like here on settings. Guys, have you noticed that my battery icon here is different than yours? If so, yes, you can change the icon to others by a tweak called Alkaline. It has two different icons, Bolus or Hibisha, I believe. And I prefer the second one, choose the right one, and then tap on Receive Rings. And you get the new battery icon here. One of the annoying things on iOS 7 is animation speed. To be honest with you, I hate the speed of animation on my iPhone 5. It's really slow. You can see. When you open up the app, I don't know, just slow. But with no slow animations, this problem will be fixed. By just dragging the, this slider from 1 to 0, everything will be great. Look, open up an app. Another annoying thing, guys. Have you had this problem when you read something on iBooks or Safari or when you watch a video? You want to volume down or volume up something or video music 
you see this so you can see beneath this icon which is really annoying for me to fix that download transparent volume and then just drag this slider to zero and everything will be awesome look The last tweak for this month is slide for usage. When you are multitasking, you can swipe down here and you can see some other options like last opened, use it for total duration. For example, notes has been opened one minute ago and I has I use it for eight seconds and the total duration is ten minutes, which is a great tweak. It tells you the usage of every single application. As you can see here. Guys, that was all for this month. I hope you enjoyed them. And if you like them, please hit the like button. And if you have anything, write it down below. Also, if you want to catch up the future videos, please hit the subscribe button. I really appreciate that. Again, in the description, I will add a link of the last series best CDI tweaks, which is about seven videos. You can check them out and enjoy those tweaks as well. Thanks for watching. Have a great time.